Hi guys, welcome back to another Dollar Tree haul. My name is Mel. If you like watching Dollar Tree hauls, um, looking for good deals, bargains, uh, please subscribe to my channel. Give me a like. I would love to have you join. Um, so today we are going to dive into the holidays. And it's so funny because at Dollar Tree right now, I literally went shopping for like the week um, last week and I picked up like three holidays. I found Easter, Valentine's Day, uh, St. Patrick's Day. So I'm so excited. I want to share it with you. Um, so let's get started. So one of the first things I was able to find were the Peeps little stuffed animal. And these are so cute. Um, these are the actual little Peeps brand and they're little soft and squishy. They're super cute. Um, perfect for the Easter basket. I'm actually going to make some little bags um, and give them away to uh, some little girls in our family. So I was so excited to find these. I think they're so cute and beautiful. Um, just adorable. So I had to get some of these. And then the next thing I got was these carrots. So in my front of the house, I have um, like, you know, my doorway entrance decorated. And I, it's kind of funny, for fall and Halloween, I bought this like hay barrel. Is that what you call it? I don't know. Um, but I've been kind of playing with it and switching it up for every holiday. So I got these. I thought they were gonna be super cute. They're picks, carrot picks. And I'm gonna stick them in the hay barrel and kind of play with it and see what I kind of create um, for my entrance. And then the next thing I got um, was, this is so cute, oh my goodness. This is the iridescent tree. It's the Easter tree that they came out with. Um, I think this is so, so cute. And it's like, let's open it up to get an idea. I haven't even opened it up, I'm so excited. Okay, let's just kinda see what we're working with. Oh, okay, this is cute. Yeah, it's just like the picture. And you know, if you like your tree a little fuller, um, definitely buy two and just put them together. I did that for the Christmas ones, um, and they looked really, really nice, nice and full. And so that was for Easter. Now we're gonna get into Valentine's Day. So I was able to pick up these cute little wooden saying signs. This one says, all you need is love. Look at that. I hope it's kind of picking up. I know sometimes I'll watch my own videos and I'm like, okay, I didn't even show the product, but hopefully you're getting this. This is so cute. Even for you crafters, DIY, um, DIYers. Um, you could even repaint this and go crazy on just this block of wood. It's just so fun. There were two sayings. This one is together is my favorite place to be. So I thought, is it the right way? It sure is. So these are adorable. I mean, I'm sure there's going to be a lot of YouTubers doing some fun stuff with these. Um, me, I think I'm going to use them just the way they are. Take one to work, maybe for my desk. Um, use one in the living room. Um, you know, I mean for 99 cents. These are awesome. So and I love the colors So I got that and then oh My goodness the little fairy Houses at Dollar Tree. I mean it gets better and better. So I picked up a few uh, Little trinkets. This one is the cake shop. I think this is so cute It's a little cupcake uh, looking house and I think the detail is so, so cute. And I'm actually gonna use these on a tear tray in my house. This one is the Ferris wheel. Look at how adorable. Oh my goodness, that is so cute. And then I know there was another piece. This is kind of just like a little decoration or perhaps like a little fence um, or whatever you wanna call it. But all these little goodies are gonna go on my tear tray. And so they are gonna just pop and look so adorable. Really excited about that. And then um, I got these glitter hearts also. So I'm going to decorate my Christmas tree, my artificial one, not the real one. Um, so I'm gonna keep that up all year long. Why not, right? 
and I'm going to kind of create just a holiday tree for every holiday. So I got these because I'm thinking on top of the tree, I'm gonna kind of stick them into the um, tool that I have as my big bow. And so hopefully I can pull it off and it'll come out okay. I'll post some pictures um, on my Instagram at Winky Face and Her to show you the difference of my Christmas tree turning into my Valentine's tree. And so that's going to be interesting. And that is going to happen this weekend. So hopefully I can whip out that video next week. Um, as you can obviously see, my Christmas decorations are still up. So this is the weekend. It's all happening. Um, we are boxing everything up and moving on to the next holiday. It's hard to say goodbye to Christmas. I love Christmas. Um, this is the Star Wars 48 Valentine's Day cards. Oh my goodness, they came out with such cute cards. And so I know school's gonna be a little different um, this year, but what I was thinking is having my son just fill some out, having little um, candy bags. And if we do randomly see anybody or any kids in the family from here to Valentine's Day, we're just gonna give it to them whenever we see them, you know, just as a fun little, here you go, you know, trinket, little Valentine wish. Um, they're so cute. I just had to buy them. Um, Star Wars is totally like having this come back because of that whole um, baby Yoda thing. So I just thought it was cute. So I picked those up and they have great selection. Oh my goodness. I saw Hello Kitty, Avengers, um, princess, Disney princesses. I mean, it's just, they're all there. So I think we can just all kind of get creative and figure out how we're going to pass these out or make it fun or just get them just to have fun with at home. And so the signs, let's see, these are so, so cute. So I was trying to read it and then I just put it up to the camera. This one says, you are my person, which is so cute. This one says, all you need is love. Isn't that cute? And look at how chunky they are. I think that is so cool. Like you could rest them like this, you know? Let's see if that works. Let's see. Yeah, so you could just rest it like that. Or if you want it the way it's intended, oops, you could rest it like that. We'll just pretend that didn't happen. So isn't that cute? But any way you set it up, it's gonna be adorable. And then I also got, these are so cute, let me stretch. So this is the love sign and on my Instagram page, I did a craft for Christmas. Um, and so I seen these and I was like, oh my goodness, that's like the same idea. And I can get, you know, a girlfriend over um, and have some fun. And so that is my goal. So um, we're gonna try to see what we can do and be creative with this. But I love these, these are so good. And is it the compressed wood? No, compressed particle wood is what I'm thinking it's called. But whatever it is, it's durable. It's fun to paint with, put glitter on, um, decoupage. I mean, you really can't mess up with these things. And even if you do, it was a dollar. So it's totally affordable because Target has similar words, but I believe their words are like $3. So for Dollar Tree, paint a dollar is awesome. So we got that. And then I'm going to stretch over here. So I got these, this is so, so cute. So it's just a hanging sign and I'm hoping it focuses. So one says like X's and O's, the other ones have like polka dots. Let me try to go slow so it picks it all up. And so these are cute if you wanna use it just like this. What I am gonna use it for is for my Valentine's Day tree, I'm just gonna rip these little guys off. So, like literally, I'm gonna rip them off. And I'm gonna put a cute little string and all of a sudden I got a quick ornament. So that's what I'm gonna do. I bought two of these and so, yep, just a quick Valentine ornament and my tree's gonna look awesome. So I got those. Then I got, doo -doo -doo, let's see, I got these cute fuzzy friends. These are so, so cute. They come in different little animals and I cannot think for the life of me the ones that they have 
I want to say they had like a cat and a dog, but don't take my word for it. Um, I got these like two weeks ago. And so, but I love them because these are so cute for little besties to split up and share. Um, you know, even, you know, siblings, you know, give one to the other. I mean, it's just so, so cute. What a great idea. And, you know, I'm always buying the little stuffed animals at Dollar Tree and usually you get like one for a dollar. So if you look at look at it like wow i got two for a dollar i mean that's a good deal right but these are super cute look at that i want my friend to give me one <laughs> so had to get it and then oh these are so cute so dollar tree has been doing an amazing job whipping out these gnomes i think everybody's on this gnome craze i know i am and so i was able to find some gnomes i think these are adorable oh my goodness um so these are actually hard to find um i found some but i got mine like really early and you know if it's a gnome i know to buy it now and don't wait till later because they will not be there um so i picked these up and the cool thing is i am going to do a raffle giveaway and so all you have to do to participate is comment below gnome giveaway and you will be entered and so it's going to run all the way through january and so the last day of january we'll pick our winner and i'll get them mailed out okay so one um we'll say two lucky winners will win one of these gnomes all right so in case you're having a hard time finding them, if you're a winner, then hey, it'll be arriving in your mail. So those are super cute. I got those. And then for my house, I picked up these little clings. I thought they were so cute. It says, be my Nomi, and you are so sweet. And look at how fun they look. They look like they're just ready to have a little party. They're having a good time, you know, full of love and joy. I love it. So I'm going to put these on my window. I just thought these were so cute. So I had to get them. Okay, so going on to the Valentine signs that we got. So I got these for my daughter because she, um, I've shared with you. Let me stretch my leg. It's going to fall asleep. Ah! Um, you know, when your foot falls asleep, it feels like that tingly needles. That's what I'm feeling. I'm feeling it. Okay. So I got these signs for my daughter. She makes like wreaths. Um, every time I say wreaths, it sounds, it sounds funny. Like I get tongue tied. I don't know. Um, but I got these for her for the wreaths that she makes um, to put something in the center. And then whatever she doesn't use, I'm just going to throw up you know, like in the house. So one of the ones I got was the Happy Valentine's Day. This is so cute. I think this looks like um, really high end, you know, um, the signs at Dollar Tree, they really outdo themselves. I love them. You know, they always come out really nice. Um, so we got that. And then this one was really interesting to me because you know you automatically think like valentine's day is like pink and red um but let me tell you blue is making its appearance and it's lovely so i got one of these and i think these are so pretty oh my goodness isn't that cute and that saying love you to the moon and back that's such a popular saying like i know there's jewelry that has that saying there's knickknacks um there's like um wall paintings uh pictures i mean it's a really popular saying so i thought it was so pretty and especially in the blue with the glitter so i'm really curious to see the nice pretty wreath that my daughter creates with this um let's see let's see i don't want to mess that up and then the next one i got was this one here this one's gorgeous oh i love it so this one has um that like faux little uh wood you know but it's actually smooth but it looks so pretty and it has that little metal um word love and you know even if for you diyers you crafters if you did not want this i'm sure there's going to be a lot of 
um, crafters that are just going to pop off the word and use it for something else maybe. But um, I just think this is gorgeous. So I think we're going to keep it the way it is and use it um, just how we have it. And then the next sign I got that I could not resist is the welcome sign. And this is cute because I'm not really sure if I'm going to keep it like this or if I'm just going to like rip it off and use, you know, each sign separately. And then I also love the little um, pieces of hearts that you can also rip off. <laughs> Look at me. Destroy your product. <laughs> so you could also rip these off and use it for a different craft. You know, so whatever you do, I think this is like a three in one because you have one, two, and then if you use the heart separately, that's three. So that's really cool when you come across um, a product and then you think like, you know, outside of the box and you're like, well, you know, what could I use it for my purposes or how can I repurpose it? So I don't know, kind of fun. And if I keep it like this, I sure will, right? Because it's gorgeous. I think it's so pretty. So that was it for my Valentine's Day. Now let's head into St. Patty's Day. So this is so cute. So I can't resist the gnomes. So this is the little um, hand towel and it says shenanigans with my gnomies. Isn't that cute? Oh my goodness, it's just so cute. So I picked one of those up. I hope they come out with like the hand mittens. Um, I haven't seen them, but even if this is all I get, I, I'm going to be happy. They're just cute. Um, so I got that and then I got the cute little hat, um, St. Patrick's Day hat. And so I shop at Party City a lot to, um, for items and things like that. And I'm telling you, Party City has similar to almost the same thing and you know they may have like different size uh variations and things like that but even their small ones are not a dollar like so when i see things like this at um, dollar tree i just pick them up because this is such great detail it's just so cute you know um why not right so i got one of those i got one of these little guys i think he's so cute and, you know, these are going to look really good, like on my two-tier tray or, you know, just on my entertainment center, just like that. Um, also got these little wooden signs. This one says Leprechauns Welcome. Super nice. And the other says a truckload. Oops, hold on. My hands can't do that. A, what does it say? A truckload of luck. So I got that and I hope. I'm doing this right. Sometimes I forget where I should point the item. So there we go. So I think these are adorable. I've been putting them on my entertainment center. Uh, one I put on my two tier tray in my entrance and I think these are just gorgeous, gorgeous. And let me rotate my leg. Okay. And this is one of the styrofoam glitter, um, what do you call it, clover decorations. And so I'm going to get more because I can use these in my tree um, when I change it over to the next holiday, but I think these are gorgeous. And then one of the little wooden signs I got was um, this one here, and it says lucky and blessed. Isn't that pretty? And I love it. I just love it. So um, I am really excited to see my daughter make a wreath out of this one too. I think it's gorgeous. Um, and then even if, you know, for you crafters wanted to just take them apart and use them separately or kind of do, you know, something else with it, you totally can. So this one's like a two for one. What? Yeah, pretty cool. Um, last but not least, I got a banner and this is so cute. So this is the St. Patrick's Day banner. And I mean, oh my goodness, you know, when you see things like this at Dollar Tree, it just gets me so excited because, you know, you're so used to Dollar Tree, you know, doing things that are like made out of paper um, that possibly may not last or, you know, if you put them away and then boom, they bust out with 
items like this that are made out of felt, you know, that will hold up in storage. And it's just gorgeous. Just gorgeous. Look at this. Oh my God. I'm so excited. Oops. I am so excited. Okay. All right, the string is not cooperating. There we go. So look at how cute. Oh my gosh, this is adorable. Adorable. I mean, I could even put this on my entertainment center on top. I can put it, you know, in the hallway. I could even put this as garland around my tree, you know, for St. Patty's Day. I mean, it's whatever you want to use it for, you know, be creative. Um, but this is so neat, such good quality. So I'm really excited when I find things like this. So that was the last item. Thank you guys for watching. I appreciate all of you. Please subscribe to my channel. Um, I'm gonna do a couple more videos for this week. I know I took some time off last week. Life got so busy, but um, a lot of stuff going on. But I never stopped shopping, so I am backed up on product, and I wanna share with you all my goodies um, because I'm gonna start decorating, and so we need to put this stuff up. So um, subscribe, hit the likes button, uh, be well, be safe, and I will see you soon.